Uh, I was going to leave it for another minute, um, but the game just decided that it wants to go to the demo screen. So it's trying to load the demo, and I don't know how long this is going to take. Okay. Never mind, I guess we're not waiting another minute, we're just going with two minute intro instead. Uh, okay. I accidentally mute myself, I meant to do... what is it? It's that one. There we go. Okay. So I spent a little bit of time last night setting this up, making sure it worked, and I think it works fine. The only problem I could find is that you can see lights through walls and that's it. That's the only issue I saw with this. I'm just going to take a look because I, I might have fixed it last night because it stopped happening, but then it's... I don't know, I didn't test it again so it might have started happening again. We'll take a quick look to see if uh, lights can be seen through walls or not, and if they can, then, oh well, that's not my problem. Um, it really doesn't matter if I can see lights through walls, but yeah, okay, so that's still happening. That's fine. Um, it really doesn't make a difference in the sort of like grand scheme of things. Uh, it's just going to be a little bit annoying that that's happening. No, don't update save game data. So, I don't think I've ever beat the game on normal. I think I tried it, but I really don't like this game that much, so... We'll just go for a thing on easy, we'll give it a try on normal, then we'll give it a try on hard after that, and I don't think I'm going to get very far, but... Oh yeah, this game has animations, doesn't it? I forgot about that. I forgot this game has animations for like character selection. Because Sims Wars 2 is the only one that doesn't for some reason. Also those chunky, chunky PS2 polygons. <laughs> this was like a PS2 launch title, so it's it's really not very good looking, but like, visually it's it's not great, compared to Times Wars 2 at least. I think Times Wars 2 has aged pretty well, considering how old it is. Um, Future Perfect doesn't really look bad either. Okay, let me see if I actually remember anything. I'm pressing the wrong button, it's supposed to be that one I'm supposed to be pressing, so... Right. Yeah, the aiming in this one is a bit weird from what I remember. It's not really like the... Where am I going? I should have left that for later. Like, it, it's still sort of snappy, like in Sons of the but it doesn't feel as snappy to me. Uh, right. Also, there's completely different weapons that I'm not seeing anywhere else because of course there are. Uh, okay. They actually give you health packs in this game, wow, I'm impressed. To be honest, I can probably just run through most of this without too much difficulty, given how not very difficult this is. Oh, there's the thing, okay. Yeah, the levels are longer if you're not uh, playing on thingy. On easy, just like in Time Quarters 2, but... I'm on the wrong way. Where am I even going? Oh, it's this way. Yeah, there okay. And then up here, and then the exit is right over there. Yeah, so that's that. That's the basic formula. It's basically just go through the level, pick up an object, go to a different place in the level, levels over, that's it. It's not very difficult to do or get your head around. Um, and the whole sort of premise for story for these sort of story mode is just do it quickly and do it quicker and keep doing it quicker. 
Which, I don't know, that's kind of neat I guess, but I'm not a huge fan of it. Um, I'll just play through like every level once and then I might go through them a couple more times, like I said, but... Oh, yeah. uh, I think I should be sort of fine then on easy for like health because I was taking a bit of damage there but if I can just like kill everyone pretty quick it shouldn't be much of a problem it seemed like. So... I'll go through everything on like each difficulty if I can but I'm not sure if I'll be able to. Also, the loading screens are really long for some reason. Not shall I? Okay. The hell? What is that guy doing there? Okay, that's fine. Probably. Yeah, this is not going anywhere nearly, nearly how I wanted that to. Oh well. Where am I actually going? Where's... I guess over here. Like, if you don't know where you're going, just follow the enemies. That's a pretty good... It's not this way. <laughs> okay, never mind. That's not a very good indicator of where you're supposed to go. Because the enemies took me the wrong way. Thanks. Thanks again. So it's this way. Hi! Yes, it is me, Mocha. Hello. What, what am I doing? I don't know. I don't know where I'm going anymore. Uh, I'm doing okay, I guess. Is it down here? Oh, that's a wall. Oh wow, it's actually like ridiculous zoom on that. Huh. Can I not die here? That would be nice. Okay, that's the thing then that I was looking for. Wait, hold on, what are the... Uh, I guess the bag prevents you from carrying double weapons. Okay, that's annoying, whatever. Okay, now, now where do I go? <laughs> that's like half of this game, just where do I go now? I don't know. Uh, is it over here? No. There was an enemy spawn point over there, but there was no nothing over there I need. Where am I going? Is it just back the way I came? Oh yeah, it is. Okay. Right, I can probably do that re a lot quicker then. Like, that doesn't seem that bad. Although these loading times are like the worst part of this. Uh. I'll give that one another try just because I, I can definitely do that one quicker. And considering that's like 90% of the way they intended for this game to be played, sure, you know, I'll I'll, I'll give in, I'll, I'll try and do it quicker. But yeah, I'm doing pretty okay at the minute. I'm just a bit tired and I think I've got a bit of a headache, but that's fine. I don't really mind that much. I should be fine, hopefully. Uh, okay. Can I... That was... dumb. Uh... <laughs> you don't need your head anywhere. Yeah, that's true. Who needs a head when you can... not have one? Okay, so it's not that way, it's this way. And then... where was it? It was over here. Okay, that's a little bit awkward actually, yeah. Never mind. <laughs> clever? W what was clever? I don't know what I said. Wait, what? I, I, I don't- I actually don't know what I said. I'm gonna die again. Uh, 
Ah, uh, that's fine. Okay. <laughs> that's fine. Probably? Oh, I'm pretty sure you should be quicker at diagonal in this game. I think that's a, I think that's a real thing. Uh, what should I do for my 100 follow and or 20... That was like a minute faster, okay. Uh, what should I do for my 100 follow and or 25 sub celebration? Uh, I don't know. Um, eat an article of clothing because you got drunk and aware that's probably... Um, I don't know. I can't think of anything. Uh, okay, I need to do cyber den. Uh, next one. Oh boy! It's hundred for landers when it's five sub celebration. I'm not sure what the a good thing to do for that would be. Depends entirely on what you'd be willing to do for it. I can't think. I actually can't think of anything. Wait, where am I going? Oh, over here. What is this loading time? Yeah, I know. It's it's really awful, and I have no clue why. I shouldn't have picked up that health. Why did I do that? I was on full health. I. I why did I do that? Yeah, the loading time is abysmal, but... Okay, no, that definitely seems like faster movement if you do a diagonal. Like, the gun is bobbing way quicker. Where am I? Oh, okay. What? What? Oh, okay. <laughs> right. Th this is... definitely not what I was expecting this level to be. But um, this actually seems really. Huh, okay. Um. Wait, is that it? Oh, that's it. Okay. This is kind of weird. This is like. I feel like you could just make this level in the map maker for this game. Where am I even going? Oh, this is back at the start, okay. Is it over here? Yes. Well, that was good. Now I've got to sit through a short loading time and then wait for another really long loading time. Obviously there's only three levels in the whole game, that's it. The game's done now. We just finished all three levels, that's it. Game over. Uh, oh no, wait, Village. Village. This one's fun. This one is actually a lot of fun because it's really short. It's like, absurdly short. The loading time is probably going to be longer than the level itself. That's actually really depressing to say that out loud, Jesus Christ. Uh, why does this take so long to load? How long is this taking? Okay, that long. This is actually a really cool level though because it is like it's like obviously inspired by um what you call them. There's the item. Getting stuck, good. Um, and that's the level. <laughs> that either took the same amount of time as it took to load, or less. Uh, inspired by Half-Life. Uh, I was gonna say what you call it, um, Shadow of Innsmouth, I wanna say? 
Lovecraft. Inspired by Lovecraft. Uh, I forgot what that book's called now. I want to say it's Shadow of Rinsworth, but I don't remember if that's right. Uh, I'll do it again, but I'll actually like do it properly this time. Yeah, the fishing village. Yeah, because all of the enemies as well in that level, which I didn't really get a chance to look at because I just sort of ran past them all, are uh, sort of like weird mutants as well. I'll, I'll give it another like actual... It's loading time. Uh, I'll give it like another actual look because it is like an actually kind of interesting level, but... Yeah, it's just a shame the game takes like seven years to load. And it's also a shame that on easy it's really short. <laughs> yeah, like you've got all these weird muni guys going on. Am I getting shot from... Okay. Yeah, the, the, why, why am I trying to use the manual then? The final area of the Bloodbound DLC is heavily inspired by Shadow and Smith. Oh, cool. So I'm still not sold on buying a PS4 just to play that one game now. <laughs> uh, can you please die? Thank you. But yeah, then there's this whole like other area that you go on if you go on hard or medium. I fell in the water. Yeah, there's a whole area over there that goes to a cave and then you get the thing in there instead. But yeah, that's a really short level. It's less than 30 seconds. And that was with me like getting stuck like twice as well. Uh, a chemical plant. <laughs> You could steal one instead. I could steal one, probably, but I could probably also steal a copy of Bloodborne as well from someone, but that means I have to go through the effort of doing it, and I'd rather not. I haven't read much Lovecraft new, no, I just know sort of like the general stuff. I haven't read much in years, to be honest. Um. But no, I haven't read much Lovecraft. Oh wow, what a cool sniper rifle. Yeah, I'm not going to use a sniper rifle, that just seems useless and impractical when the pistol is... a pistol. Oh, there's people there. Uh, I'm a fan of Lovecraft for a bunch of stuff. I... I'm sure like if I actually... Oh no. Had sort of like the chance to sit down and read some of it, I'd probably enjoy like all of it, but... I just don't really feel like I have much time to do that. I mean I definitely do, it's just there's other stuff that like I always prioritise over, stuff like that. Where am I? Wait, the end is literally just down here, right? I'm stuck. Okay. Okay. <laughs> uh, get to see me get super spooked. Oh great. I'm gonna- wow, that was quick. Why is my controller vibrant? Okay, I just started vibrating for no reason. Uh, right. Oh, fuck. Okay. That's fine. Why did I reload there? That was almost awful. I've gone the wrong way, haven't I? No, it was the other way, yeah. Why are there so many enemies in this level? What the f- Why are there this many enemies? Like, what? There we go. Okay. Like, this is a definite difficulty curve right here, like,
Like, why did you even... Why did he even... Okay. This is just... I am confused. There is just too much going on. Okay, what's over here then? A man in the dark. That's what's over here. Why? Why are there just men stood in the dark? This is awful. <laughs> oh god. Oh no, wait, this is actually... Okay, this is actually a better way up than the way I was going. Uh... There's those two. There's you. Okay. That's a problem, but... It's this one that runs in and keeps hitting me. That, that's killing me. Okay. That, that's also a really short little... Never mind. I'm sure it'd be way longer if it was on a high difficulty, but... Still, that's... Not great. Why did I unlock so much after that? I didn't even, like, do anything. Planet X. This is why there's a level called Return to Planet X in Time Splitters 2. Because this is the original Planet X. Ooh. It looks nothing like the one in Time Splitters 2. They're completely different. <laughs> I, I, I don't get what's so Return about Return to Planet X, because they're completely different levels, but... I mean, they're both sort of, like deserty planets I think and they have aliens in them. That's about it. Maybe. I don't remember. It's been a while since I've lost some this. Oh, why do I have a... Okay, there we go, that's better. I guess the, the main thing that's like Return to Planet X about is the music probably. Okay, I don't know where I'm going anymore. Yeah, none of these aliens are in the time for the one, so that's good. Why are there so many enemies? This is... Like, it went from, like, not many enemies at all to just all of them at once. And... I'm not sure how I feel about that. Wait, that's the that's the end. Where? <laughs> Dangerous difficulty codes. Oh, there it is. There's the brain in a jar. Okay, brain in a briefcase. I don't remember what it is. I think they actually like reuse that in some place too, though. So then, wait. I'm I'm lost. I forgot which way I went. I've gone the wrong way. I think. Maybe. Where the fuck am I? What, what is this? Where have I gone? This is not where I thought I was going, but okay. Why is that like... Okay, yeah, just kill, just kill me, please. That was a lot of vibrations. Okay. Right. So don't go the way I just went. I don't know which way I just went. Uh... Is this where any of us thought we were going? I don't know. I don't know where I am anymore. I've gone the wrong way. Is this where? There's too many enemies. Wait, which way was it? Was it this way? Like, this is the way to the end. Okay. So this is the end of the level. Then... Oh, it's back up here. Okay. Right, okay, I've got it. I'm just stupid and wait. No, this is the way I went last time. Wait. So 
So it's down here. Yeah. Uh, yes, you go down to go up. Okay, got it. I'm not doing that again. <laughs> I'm guessing that the area I accidentally went to that had nothing in it was where it would have been on normal and hard, but I don't know. Who knows? Mensch, uh, this is. I know what, I've got extra levels. Wait, that's the last level. I can just play the last level right now. Cheats menu. When did I unlock cheats? Yeah, that's all the levels in the game, by the way. That's every single one. Mansion. Great. The zombies in this game are really annoying because you can only kill them by detaching their heads. Uh, if you don't shoot them in the head, they just don't die. I think you can, like, knock them over if you shoot them in the body, but they just get back up a few seconds later, so... Fun! <laughs> Because obligatory horror level, which was then reused in times was huge perfect, where they had an obligatory horror level, and also in oh uh, yeah, that's what happens if you don't shoot the head off. Fun. These are the same animations that oh, you're still alive. Yeah, these are the same animations they used in Sam's Lost 2, actually, now that I think about it. Where am I...? Huh. Well, at least they reused the animations. Fair enough. Okay, you're still alive. That's gonna... <clears throat> I was prepared for someone to do that, but I wasn't sure where it would be from. Fair enough. That's really annoying. Can you please move? Okay, never mind. Given the golden eye state of aiming, hitting anything in the head sounds impossible. I mean, sometimes the auto aim does it. If the auto aim doesn't do it, it doesn't do it. So it's entirely down to luck or getting lucky with the manual aim. There is a definite, like, finesse to aiming manually. Oh great, zombies have guns, that's not annoying at all. Um, what? I'm sorry, did I just get shot by a moose head? Did, did I just get shot by a moose head? Wait, this isn't even where the exit is. Why am I clearing this area out? Can you please let me pass? Thank you. Yeah, I really don't have a reason to actually like clear out anything over here. Uh, where? What is? Oh, it's just a wall. Okay, great. Can you please go away? But yeah, like, there's a... Okay. Uh, there's like a certain, like, height where if you aim around that you'll probably hit people in the head most of the time, but it's not always... I... Who shot me? I, I, I saw the, the, the moose head start turning around again, but I definitely didn't get shot by it that time. Okay. This would be much less annoying if they weren't teleporting in on me like that. That would be fun. Thank you. Like, the, the, the range there that they're teleporting in at is stupid. Why? Wait, you're not here. Now you're here. Okay. Oh, thank god. Right, health. Please go away. <laughs> Please go away.
Do I have the teleport, enemy teleport in at all? That's a very good question. I don't know. Especially when the enemies do that bullshit. Like, oh, that's the guy that was shooting me. No, you are definitely aiming at me. Okay. Why are they turrets? I don't understand. I... Some sort of hardware limitation, maybe, but the thing is, after they spawn in, all the enemies are still there. It's not like other enemies despawn. All the enemies that spawn in exist at the same time as everything else, so I'm not sure why they do that. Oh, this is giving me some uh, Resident Evil vibes. Okay. Uh... I, I don't know if that would necessarily be because of hardware limitation. Really? They just spawn him in right there. Okay. That's not ammo. Where is the where is the whatever I'm looking for? I'm so confused. Um Is it back here then? Wait no, I went up here, didn't I? And there was nothing. Seems like a weird choice. It makes sort of sense why, like, they teleport enemies in once you've collected the item because that's like to make it difficult on the way back. But on the first time through the level, I'm really not sure why they do it because it, yeah, it doesn't make sense for them to. Where am I going? It it, it really doesn't make sense for them to do it like the first time through. Oh, did I not go over here? Oh, I didn't go over here. Oh great! Where am I getting shot from? Yeah, it, it, it doesn't really make sense, and I'm not going to question it because, I don't know, it j can you- Oh my god. <laughs> How was that even a headshot? That wasn't even, like, anywhere near the- okay, you weren't- um, thank you. Wait, was that- I thought I walked into something because I got stuck for a second, but no, I shouldn't pick that up. This is a long level. Um, why am I? Why? Why do that? Why? 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 Why do that? That's no. Don't do that. That's dumb. Don't. Don't. That's was was that texture like fighting? And it's just a lighting. Okay. See, that guy was just stood there with a shotgun. Why wasn't that zombie just stood there with a shotgun instead of teleporting in the moment I turned the corner? Like, they can do it. They have done it. That guy was just stood there. Why weren't you? Why wasn't the other one just stood there? I don't. I don't know. That is a, a skybox, yep, okay. Uh, how did I miss that? Okay, that's what I'm looking for, I guess, but where's the exit? Is it down here then? Okay, it's right there, right. Uh, so it's literally just... Fun. So it's down here, then I'm dead because shotguns. Okay, I'm just gonna ignore like as much as I can because it doesn't. So don't do that, please. Thank you. Oh, I'm gonna die. Okay, they're going to be coming up now. I've gone the right way, haven't I? Yes. Oh, for... Okay, if I can just hit you once, you don't have a gun anymore. That's all I care about. Then there's health here, right? Yeah. Oh my god. <laughs> See, I definitely don't think it's a hardware limitation. Like, they're all still here. They- oh, it's this way, yeah. Uh, 
Okay, that's actually a good thing I went down there then. Um, just drop your guns, please. That's all I want. Okay, you're gonna teleport in. That's fine. You're gonna shoot me. A lot. Why can you rapid fire shotguns? Why why can they rapid fire shotguns? Wait, there's no guy here this time. Th there was a guy here last time. Okay, you're gonna teleport in as I walk over here. Wait wait what? Maybe it actually is a thingy then. Maybe they're not spawning in because there's too many enemies. Okay, I get it. So it is a high organization, sort of. It's sort of a hard well limitation, but at the same time it's sort of just the game applying like a weird limit to the enemies. Which means it's probably easier if I just do this. Uh, okay. No shotgun guys. You're still there, but... Nobody's here. How nice is that? <laughs> okay, at the moment I figured out how to um how to game the enemy spawning to my advantage was the moment this game became too easy. Okay. So that's why they spawn enemies in. It's because there's only a, there's a limit to the amount of enemies they can have at a time and only certain amount of enemies can exist, so there you go. That's why there's a that's that's a really dumb excuse to spawn enemies like five meters in front of you, but okay. Okay, so basically kill as few enemies as possible so that they clog up the spawn list somewhere else in the level so that you can just run to the end. <laughs> That's the way you're supposed to do this. Got ya. I understand now. Ah, uh, okay. Early PS2 games. Ah, <laughs> uh, right, where is the- okay, the exit isn't here at least, so that's good. I want that assault rifle. I take it back, I'm gonna kill people just to get the weapons at this point. Actually, these people might have weapons that are just Worth taking. Maybe not. Where am I even? Uh. Oh, hi. Nothing here. That's a turret. Well, there's the exit. Which definitely means that I've missed whatever I'm looking for somewhere. It'll be in there, won't it? Probably. Why? That's a lot of enemy. It's just two, but. At completely different angles that I wasn't expecting. Uh, is that it? No, that's a grenade launcher. Okay. Uh, where is it? Just up here. I blew myself up. Good. Yeah, the grenade launcher can just fuck off for all I care. That's not. Oh, that's what I'm looking for. Okay, right. No, no, this is not going to be possible to do without. Ma Actually, never mind. I, I can just leave now. Wait, I didn't pick it up. I thought I picked it up. I didn't pick it up. Okay, good. So it is inside the warehouse. I know that now. Where? Wait, can I not? Where? Is there no way to. Okay. Let's try that again. So not that one. Uh, here it was, yeah. 
and then up here, and then down here, and then... I should probably take that now, probably. Jesus, that's awkward. Okay. Wait, no, that's armour. That's not what I'm looking at. Oh, that's armour that I picked up. Right. Oh, no, it's... It's in the next room across. Okay. I get it. I see what I'm supposed to do now. Okay. So go this way, then that way, and then just keep moving diagonally because speed. That's not what I wanted to do. <laughs> I tried to equip the uh, thingy, the shotgun, but it didn't work. It must be to the right of it. Oh, the weapon on the left rather, not to the right. Because I went to the right and it was a sniper rifle. <laughs> okay, that health is probably important enough to take. I went the wrong way. Where am I? I'm over here, which means I'm back out here, which means I'm back at the start of the level, which means I need to go this way and I'm gonna die. Okay. Understood. Probably gonna die anyway. No idea how I survived that, but okay, that's fine. That that really shouldn't have worked. Uh, I just realised I don't have something open that I'm supposed to have open. Rip. I need to open that real quick. Uh, and then shuffle, shuffle that across to the side. What the fuck? Uh, let, let me just replay this donation from 20 hours ago. Towards stuff and things. Um, I don't know why the font was so small, but uh. Thanks, Domino's guy? Why? Why would you do that? <laughs> I'm not complaining, but why? <laughs> uh, okay. What the fuck? Okay, right, fine. <laughs> yeah, he just... He, he did it. Fifty pounds last night, apparently. I don't know why. Oh yeah, there's also Gretel. That is... I forgot how Gretel looked in this game. Robot nips. Okay, we've got some robot nips. Why? <laughs> Why? I, I don't know what I'm asking why to anymore. I'm not sure if I'm asking why to robot nips or why to the £50, but... Okay, that's fine. That has taken me off guard a little bit. <laughs> robot nips. It's not the focus of the stream, so Twitch can't get me banned. <laughs> Except for when, like, the game decides to freeze on it for like 30 seconds because of the absurd loading times. Space Wars is... I was going to say, Space Wars is probably like one of the most unique levels in the game, but... I did tell Dominus ask how you rushed me give you all this money. That's true, you did. Grab your duty free... Oh, I forgot each level actually has its own like description as well, okay. Grab your duty free goods on board the Yariel Express. 
Well do. I like something. That audio. Okay. It's too much for the audio. Uh Minigun? Did someone say minigun? Oh hello. The minigun has to reload. Why does the minigun have to reload? I really need health. I'm probably gonna die in a second. Where is the... Do I have to go higher? Well, the Ureal Express. I mean, I'm guessing this is the, uh, the Ureal Express, but... I have no clue. Oh, it'll be here. Yeah, it's here. How the hell did I not die there? Oh wow, credits. There's Free Radical! Why is it so blurry? Steve Nellis. David Doak. Duck? Duck? Steve- David Duck? Graham Nugget. There he is. Legendary guy. I absolutely love all the songs that Graham has made for the series. It's Graham. Ezra Allen. The, the single anime. Singular. One. <laughs> I wonder how long this is going to go on for because I, I don't think Free Radical were a big team at the time. They had two background artists but only one anime. Huh. Yeah, it was fast. I've only been streaming for like 50 minutes. It's not a very long game, but... See, this is what you paid for back when the PS2 came out. You bought this, apparently. I never bought this until many, many years after it had come out, but this is what you bought. <laughs> you bought this and you were happy with your, like, nine really short levels that you were encouraged to speedrun over and over again. Honestly, I think these credits are longer than most of the levels, yeah. I, th I think that's true. These credits are definitely longer than villages, at least, because village is only like 20 seconds, so... Idos QA? Idos QA? Okay, apparently a lot of people were related to the skin. Special thanks to all of you. Some of which may or may not be alive anymore because this game came out, like, over 15 years ago? There's a chance at least one of these people might have died in that time, so... Rest in peace if any of them have. But... Time Splitters will return. Well, Time Splitters will not return because I finished all the games. <laughs> Is it just gonna carry on? Man, they were really proud of their tunnel effect, weren't they? Oh no, it just loops. Okay. So technically this can go on forever, which means that it does last longer than the rest of the game. <laughs> that's that's really dumb. Okay. Uh, what now? I'm not sure. Um, well, we've unlocked challenge mode. And from what I can tell, challenge mode has more content than the rest of the game. So... That's not a joke. I, I think I was actually told that when I was doing the Future Perfect stream. That, that the focus for this game was more on challenge mode than the actual story, so... I guess we're doing challenge mode! <laughs> because there's more content here. The behead the undead, because beheading the undead was easy enough already. Oh great. What level are we playing? What level are we playing? What weapons have we got? What, what's the setup? How, how are we doing this? I want to know. 
I, I would like to find out sometime in the next... Oh, okay. Yeah, behead the undead when it's, um... With these controls, with this aiming system, is, um... No. Uh, in times what I see it was better because even if you like missed you could still kill the zombies with body shots which you know a shotgun that's pretty likely to get body shots at least but not in this game because they just fall over and don't die. Uh, I don't know what they were thinking with this like why make a system where which requires precise aiming or extreme luck with the auto aim to wait I'm dead. Oh right, okay. Right, I see, it doesn't matter it's just the timed thing, so it doesn't matter, I can just keep dying as long as I keep killing them. I get it. Okay, well that takes some of the challenge out of it, at least. Yeah, this is kind of not great. Oh wait, you're dead. I'm not gonna have time to do this. Are you kidding me? Is this a joke? Okay, we're doing this again. Ah, fuck. If the aiming was any better. I might need to end a bit lower actually, that's the problem. They definitely turned back the zombie designs for two though. Oh really? They're not even hitting me like half the time. I think they're hitting each other more than they're hitting me to be honest. Also I swear I've heard some of these zombie sounds in Future Perfect. They've really got their mileage out of like everything that they use in this game. They reuse the zombie animations for two, they reuse some of these sound effects for free. Oh god, please, no. Yeah, this aiming system is the absolute worst. You know, when when you're um, when you're making like the first major console first person shooter, you know, it might be fine to have a bit of a jank aiming system. A few years later, down the line, when you're doing your own thing, maybe try and find something better or make it more tolerable like in times what is two <laughs> this is not fun to aim at all wait why did i do it again i don't want to do it again like there's just something that feels wrong about the aiming in this game in times what is two it feels fine because it's very sort of loose with where you with where you have to aim but in this game it's just no it feels like it's a mixture of too precise but also loose and like it's it's a little bit too precise is what it is I think is is the problem. Oh great Ma! See if you can knock thirty heads off in one minute with only your bare knuckles. Do I have to? Why are these challenges all with Tipper? <laughs> I'm not. 
I'm not complaining. Tipper is like the best character, but why are all of these using Tipper as the character that you play as? I don't know. Uh, PS2 emulator complete. With I mean, yeah, you can't say they. Sk it's the same level. It's the same thing again. Just I don't have a shotgun and I have to punch them. Which is somehow easier than shooting them. But also somehow way worse. Like, sometimes I'm punching off multiple heads in a row, sometimes I'm only doing none of them. I, I got it first try. Okay. I think it says something about the aiming when it's easier to punch the heads off zombies than it is to shoot the heads off zombies. I think that really says something about the uh, the aiming in this game. <laughs> uh, what's next? Uh, the ghouls come out. Wait, what? If you score 10,000... Oh no. This sounds like it's gonna be regular sort of behead the, head the undead from like Time Plus 2 and Future Perfect because it's using an actual point system instead of just shoot off so many heads, but we'll see. Ah, okay. And even then doing it with this aiming and... Is it in the same area again? Because it said the mansion... No, don't tell me it's in the same area again. They wouldn't reuse the same area three times. They 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 wouldn't do they wouldn't do that. They fucking did it. Wait, I'd have a oh, I have to get a shotgun. Yeah, so this is actually just like I have the undead from the later games then. Except it's going to be way worse because the aiming is absolutely awful. Did it say I needed 10,000 points? If you score 10,000... Oh my god. Wait, what? Oh, there's entrances over here. Okay, I get it. But you, you're alive. Okay, so that's only 10 waves then. Okay, got it. It's not that bad. Do they have shotguns? Am I, was he carrying a shot? Don't tell me he was carrying a shotgun. They have shotguns, I think. Unless I'm going crazy. No, I'm just going crazy and I'm dead because this is awful. Okay, yeah, this is not gonna be easy to do. Um, so they start over here, right? Yeah. And then over here, or is it up there? And then over here. Then. No, I don't think that they did have shotguns actually, I was just mishearing something, but I don't, I don't know what I was hearing. Uh, that made me think it was... Okay, I was leaving the area, whoops. Yeah, I'm not doing that. Okay, phase two. Wait, what? Oh no. They spawn out of like every single entrance at once on the second phase. How is this? Oh no.
Okay, I think upstairs is probably the safest place then. Uh, I'm using a controller. A keyboard and mouse with this aiming setup would just feel awful. Unless it actually has like proper mouse support. I don't know, maybe it does. Who am I to know? Oh my, please die. Uh, no. I'm getting a lot of mileage out of like setting up the PS3 controller for like Symphony of the Night, I'll be honest. There we go. Right. Go get the shotgun ammo and then go back upstairs. Yeah, this is going to be the easiest way to do this, without a doubt. Just stay upstairs, they can't come up, and then... Uh, would the aiming be easy with mouse? I have no clue. And I don't want to find out. Okay, there's one over there. Oh no, they're behind me. No, they're not. Wait, there's a radar. They are behind me. What am I talking about? They're all underneath me. Yeah, they're, they're all under. But now there's some over there. Okay. Fun! There's the one. There is one. I need to keep an eye on the radar actually, because otherwise I'm gonna end up dying because of it. This is dumb. This is really dumb. Why is this a thing? Honestly, it's harder to hit them in the head from up here. But at least I can't die, so... Oh, come on. No, please. This is, this is just too hard to do. How did that not... Okay, there we go. Doesn't help that they're running around in circles like that. Oh, please. Oh, for God's sake, the floor's blocking it. Okay, right. Go get more ammo and then go back up and then... Where do I have max ammo? Oh no, it goes up even higher. Okay, good. Wait here. Okay, one's coming up that I need to keep my out for. Oh no, two are up. Well, they're gone, so... It might be easier to lure them over to the stairs, actually, because then I don't have to deal with... Uh, what do you call it? Them sort of like moving around in weird places. Ugh, come on, please. Come over to the stairs. You're not even coming up with the set. What are you doing? Can't even cooperate. Okay. Right. <sighs> and then back over here. Have all of you spawned yet? No, there's a few more, I think. Oh no. Yeah, I'm hitting the enemy limit, so they keep spawning like after the fact. Uh, okay. Wait, you can move a set. Oh, thank you so much. That makes you so much easier to kill. Why are these zombies so annoying? Like... Oh, wow, they're actually going up the... No, they're not. 
I was gonna say, they seem like the most annoying zombies out of any video game, but... Yeah, no, I definitely think that's true. If they were in any other game though where you could actually aim, this wouldn't be a problem. I need to go do some adulting. It's been fun, okay. Uh, have fun with whatever your adulting is. Uh, and then... One more. That should be it, right? That's 10,000, please. Okay, good. I can die now. It was 10,000, right? If he's got 10,000 points, yeah. And then you, and then was there another one over there? No. Oh wow, you're actually coming up the stairs again. It's weird, it seems like they come up the stairs sometimes, but then not there's one behind me. Okay, that's fine, I don't care. I did it. I'm not doing it again. No, screw you. I, I don't care what you say. I'm not, I'm not doing it again. Once is enough. Twice is too many. Three times is... Uh, I don't know. Three times is also too much. Okay, so I unlocked something else, Grant. Duck hunting season. Okay, let's see if we can bag 100 and... Okay, so this is just deathmatch where you kill... Hey, I'm a busy man. I ain't got all day. <clears throat> let's get down to business, huh? Okay. Uh, yeah, so this is basically just going to be a deathmatch where I'm killing Duckman Drake, isn't it? Duckman Drake. Duck, like, be duck men, Jerk, because there's multiple duck men. And a single duck man is just duck man. So I'm killing not just the duck men, but the duck women and duck children too. <laughs> Why am I doing this? This is dumb. Uh, okay. Oh god. Uh, I've got five minutes to kill Buck Pendrick. Good. Why are you here? How much health am I? I haven't lost any health yet, have I? Oh no, I'm just not losing much health is what's going on. I am losing health just not like a whole lot for some reason. Uh that's that duckman dead. There's another duckman. More duckman. This is... I am very not sure about any of this anymore. Why am I still playing this? I've like finished the game at this point. I should probably do like medium and maybe hard as well, but... sure like where the duckmen are though. Oh they're all here and they're all dead. Every single one of them. All of the duck men, all of the duck children, all of the duck women. I have murdered them all. I don't like sand. <laughs> uh 
Uh, where uh there they are. Oh god. There's too many ducks. There actually aren't enough ducks, I'm not seeing them like most of the time. I should be able to get a hundred hopefully, but that entirely depends on if they just run at me or not, because I don't no, if I'm even going to get a chance to see them half the time. How did you get up there? How did the duck man get up there? I don't see a way up there. There goes Hugh and... oh crap. Too many ducks. Stop with the ducks. This is too many ducks. I was complaining about not seeing enough ducks earlier, but... At this point, too many ducks. Are you dead? Here you are. another one. Uh, okay. Am I even going to be able to get a hundred? I actually don't know anymore. Okay, I take it back. The auto um, is actually kind of responsive. It just doesn't always feel super responsive, but... Okay, that duck lived. You live for now. Okay, that's all you did. Then there's a duck in there. I should be able to get 10 to 20 seconds, but I don't know, it's going to be close. Where are they? They're all over here. Uh, for, I'm not going to be able to do it. One more. They set these time limits really goddamn close. Like, I'm a firm believer in the Uzi being probably the best weapon in this game, but all the dual Uzis anyway. But like, I cannot kill a hundred duckmen. Someone over here, yeah. The death animations are super annoying as well because it looks like they're still alive and it doesn't get rid of the indicator above them until after they respawn, so... Like, I thought there was one there, but it was just the one that I already killed. Um... There's you. Go it. Ah, oh, come on. There's nobody there. Where am I even looking for anything at the minute? One.
Okay. Uh. I ain't really being more on that for this right now because I'm running out. Uh, there was one over here, right? Yes. I don't even know if I'm going to be able to do this because it's such like a tight time limit for it. What? Uh... Duck teleport? Ducks can teleport, apparently. Wait, where? Oh, there. I was gonna say, where did that one go? But it just went inside the warehouse, didn't it? Ah, oh, come on. Well, you're there. Go right behind me and then go out there. Yeah, I don't know if I'm going to be able to do this in two minutes, uh, one minute, one minute. Okay, it might be close again, but if they can just like spawn anywhere near me, I might be able to. Okay, that's good. That any more of that? I need a lot more of that in order for this to work. Uh, I'm gonna run out of ammo. Oh no. 95, come on, I need to just do this really quick, but I'm not going to be able to because I'm not going to have time. 100, well that's it. Okay, that could have been 101, but I'm fine with just getting 100. I, I didn't mean to reset again, why is X reset? That's really annoying. Those two should be swapped when you win because that's really annoying to deal with. Uh, new arcade bot. Okay. What's this one? Pro. And duck shot. Duck shoot. Pretty rough team from out of town. Get your famous win the match will score at least 107 minutes. Okay. So it's more of this, basically. Small shooting ducks. But this time there's another team. Ooh. That's too it's too many ducks. Well. Green alien. 
Oh, so it's just Team Deathmatch duck killing is all it is now. Right. Except that I'm by myself. Okay. Right, that makes sense. I mean, that's one way to make it more difficult. Yeah, just throw in more bots. Oh. I'm not sure why they like extended the time limit by two minutes though. Okay, now I do. Are there any weapons here? No. Are you... I... Can I start with anything? There's too many ducks. There's just always too many ducks. Why do the aliens have like all the best stuff and I just don't? It's like they, they seem to just keep getting grenade launchers and shotguns and then I just keep getting killed by them. Which is fine, but. Oh well. Am I gonna lose this? Uh, I'm gonna die here. No, I'm not. Please? Okay, health packs are actually required now. That's a plus, I guess. Okay, this is way, way easier for some reason. I feel like I'm gonna do this like way quicker compared to the first time I'm here. This one behind me, no, it's not. Wait, yeah, there are. What am I talking about? Wow, the assault shotgun is good. Okay. The assault shotgun is really good, apparently. I didn't know this. Because I never got a chance to use it in the like, single player, because I just sort of went to use the wrong weapons. But yeah, this is actually really good. That is just like a one hit kill no matter what it seems like, but... Yeah, that's absurd. I don't know why that's so powerful. Uh... Hey, did I get that one? I must have got that one. Yeah, that's ridiculous how much damage that shotgun does. That's probably the weapon that kept killing me earlier. 
Oh, you're already dead. Yeah, that, that animation is really bad. Well, I've hit 100 again, so... Is that it? Must win with a score of at least 100, yeah, after that. Well, that was easy, so... what now? I just wait another minute, I guess? Yeah, I feel like if I'm going to get killed, it's going to be because of an auto shotgun. Or a soul shotgun, or whatever it's called. Whatever this weapon is called. Uh... I blew myself up, but it doesn't matter because I'm running. And I've already finished this challenge, so... There's another here. Okay, 130. Press triangle, not X, because otherwise I'll redo it and I don't want to redo it. Cheat level. Great, I don't know what cheat that is. I guess I can have a look right now. If I go back and then I could. Yeah. Oh, it was big heads. Okay. Uh, restaurant surf. Oh, wow, we're gonna get like an actual different. Are we playing as the. No. Wait, we're letting the duck live. That's interesting. Okay. We're not killing the duck for once, we're actually allied with the duck. That changes things. This is going to be on Chinese then. Because from what it said, it sounded like it was going to be on Chinese. Chinese is one of my favourite levels, so. In Future Perfects, anyway, it's one of my favourite levels, alongside Disco. But. Nope. Never mind, we're still on this level. Okay. This would have been a perfect excuse to change it over to, um. To Chinese, but no. Well, we're still doing this. Oh, uh, it's an escort. Uh, we're doing escort. That's what we're doing. Yeah. So this is a, this is a game mode in this game and this game only, where you have to escort someone. And literally all you do is kill people that, that try and kill the escort. That's the game mode, isn't it fun? And I've lost. Yeah. Because escort missions are fun, so let's turn one into a challenge and then an entire multiplayer game mode. That seems like a great idea. I didn't mean to crouch, but that's fine. I also need to keep an eye on my health for this, because otherwise I'm going to have run into issues. I need to pay attention to the duck, but I also need to pay attention to my own health, which is not fun. Is that not a shot? No, that's 
just the regular one. I was hoping that'd be the assault one, but it's not. Are you coming out behind? Yeah. No, you're not. You're going above. No, you're not. You're going behind. What? Was that the double one? Yep, it is. Okay, four and jump reveal. That should be enough. Okay, I should be fine now. Escort missions. Yay. Where am I getting shot from? I just shot the duck myself, that would have been bad. Okay, well they can only come from over here now, so... And over here. Are we done? Graham. I'm not doing that again. I pressed reset. I, <laughs> I'm not doing that again. I'm not doing that again. What do we unlock for saving Duckman Jerk? A new playable character. Is it the duck? It's gonna be the duck, isn't it? Uh, right, so I've also unlocked that one. Uh, Garrett. Uh, Tim and Jarrell, if I only had a bar angel or a man is out on the streets when you decide to swim, can you go put in a box and then keep all of them for one minute? Okay. That's fine. Uh, so this is what? Bag tag? Yeah, this will be bag tag, I think. Yeah, it'll be bag tag, is what this game mode is, but it'll have a win requirement of one minute. So, I should probably do the Times Letters 2 challenges at some point because they're more fun and interesting. Uh, okay, why is everyone else just growl? I'm so confused. And now I'm gonna get hunted down by everyone. Six. That's not too bad. I just need to hold on to it for like another hell of a long and that should be it. That's really not a difficult one to do. Main issue is I need a weapon. Okay. I should be fine now. Oh, there's a minute, so I'm done. Boom. Damn it. I was hoping that I could just sit there and they wouldn't notice me, but... That's fine. Uh, like, I'm, I'm cool, I was just not used to doing stuff. That's fine by me. Uh, Oh, there's a gun, right. Oh, right, well, that's actually good. How long does this go on for? Because I've already done it. I've already finished the challenge, like...
that's just a lot of fun, just blowing everyone up in that room. Okay. <coughs> well, I got it for like a fraction of a second longer. Actually, I should take the armor. Raven Carbine. I don't think I've actually like had much of a chance to use this. And I'm not going to get much more of a chance to use it. That's pretty neat. But I got the bag, I don't even have a gun. Oh, it has like a red explodey attack as well. Okay. So it's basically just like an all in the plasma rifle then. And there we go. Specifically aiming low with the rocket launcher so that even if I miss I can still hit the floor at least. Because that's some fun. I mean I'm pretty sure I actually blew myself up then. I don't think that was Alanoid's fault. I'm just gonna run around with it. I don't have a weapon so... But I don't have it. I thought I got it. Okay, I'm dead. Probably. Yeah. If I'd kept doing what like I, what I was doing to get it to a minute in the first class, I could have a pretty decent time with it, but that just wouldn't be fun, so... Uh, where's the bag? There's the bag. Two minutes fifteen. Okay. I didn't want to restart. The time limit was five minutes. Okay. So I almost had it for like half the total duration, which is I mean pretty okay to be honest. Like it could have been worse than that it was, at least. Uh what's next? Village is going procession crazy. Try to save at least 15 and 5. What? I have no clue what this one wants me to do. Save 15 in at least 3 minutes. I don't know what that means, but this might be another game mode that was exclusive to this one. Or it might be elimination. It was probably elimination, actually. Um, I don't know. We'll see. I really need a weapon as soon as it starts though. Okay, I see. Oh, I see what it is. Okay, right, it's... Uh, right, this is a... I have no clue what this game mode is, but it seems to be similar to Bag Tag. Yeah, it's just... It's not, it's not Bag Tag, sorry, it's Capture the Bag is what it is. Are you on my team? No. Okay, so I don't have a team, right? Okay, I'll take that, and then... This is really easy as well. Especially considering that I can just, like, get this and then just do that, pick up that, and then score it. I can just wait for them to do it for me, is what I can do. Uh, oh hi, a skeleton? A skeleton? 
Escalate. I've, I've definitely seen your name before. Escal Escalate. I get it. Okay. I'm, I'm, that took me a second. I'm, I'm done. It's fine. I've seen, I've seen your name before. I don't know why I was saying that. I don't know why I forgot what your name is. Uh, wait, where's the thing? Wait. Is it not here anymore? There it is. Right. Assault rifle. Okay. I will take that. Thank you. And that's that. Thank you for that free point. <laughs> this is a really dumb challenge. I, I'm not sure why this is a challenge, but it is. So... Oh yeah, I can't use times two when carrying a bag. I keep forgetting that. Is that a minigun? It is a minigun. It's a very ineffective minigun, is what it is. That is doing no damage. One time they'll say, yeah. Oh, what? Oh, right, okay. I'm being dumb, is what's going on. And then I take that, go over that, score that point. Yeah, this is. I, I was probably going off the stream soon, to be honest, because there isn't really much more of this that I feel like doing because I've already finished like the main sort of story mode. I might go through it again on normal but at the same time I also don't want to because it's sample as one. And I don't really feel like going through too many more of the other challenges. So eh. Oh wait that's the capture point for green. Okay wait why is the capture point for yellow? Is it down here? Okay right I get it. So it would be better for me just to hold this part here then. Because that way... Um, because well, green has the shortest path to it. They're going to have a free capture now, aren't they? Probably. How many have I got? Fif okay, I've done it. Was it 15? 15 five minutes, yeah. Can I... Please give me that, where is it? There it is. 16, okay. Wait. Thank you. I feel so like unarmed is really powerful. Also that sound effect whenever someone picks up a bag is really annoying. No you don't. I'm taking that. <laughs> this is really dumb. I mean, I've already finished it, so I don't really care anymore, but there we go. I'll probably do, I think, how much, what? I'm doing the second one of these, right? So I'll do the third set of this challenge and then I'll probably end off there. So that one, Baldemar there, what's this one? Uh, let me just think of visual headers. So it's just get headshot kills. So 40 headshots in, what was that, five minutes did it say? I wasn't reading it. I think it was 40 in five minutes is what it said. I do not know though, unfortunately. Uh, we'll have a look when it loads because the loading times are atrocious. Okay. 40 in 5 minutes, yeah.
Yes, because headshots with a Colt pistol are very easy to do. Uh, okay. Never mind, I've actually got... Never mind, this is going to be a really big pain in the butt to do, isn't it? Huh. That's neat. Well... I have no idea if this is going to work, so... I think I'm going to be able to do this one. Because headshots are not easy to do in this game, so... Yeah, this isn't going to work. I, I'm, I'm going to fail this one 100%, but that's fine. Wait, I'm six. Okay, this might be possible. Okay, if I can find a nice place to sit, maybe. Yeah, keep running at me. Okay, that's still not easy because of that angle there. Okay. Especially when they're all after me at once. It, I'm not sure. I'll, 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 give it a, I'll give it a good try, but... No guarantees this is going to... How did I do no damage? Okay. Like what? Please stop. Please. Okay, that's none of those are headshots. Good. This is why manual aim is better for this, but at the same time manual aim is also way more annoying to use. Please, no. There's health that I need that. That wasn't a headshot. That was. I need to go a little bit lower then. I, mean, I was aiming too high, but now I'm aiming too low. Okay, that's right. Okay, the health is back. Good. Okay, I should have this if I can just stay here without a problem. Oh no. There's health over there as well actually, so if I need like extra health for any reason, then I can get some right there. Oh no. I was looking at the wrong thing. That was not right. Please. Die already. All of you. Every single one of you. Why do you duck? That makes us so much more annoying. Why do they duck? This is already hard enough as is. Why do they have to duck on top of that? That was another one. 38 out of 5. 39 out of 5. Okay, I've got it. If I can just get one more, I've got it. Okay, 42, it's done. Ah, uh, yeah, this the Times What Was One is not a game that I would recommend anyone play. Unless you really, really want to see where the game started or where the series started. It has so many issues, it's lacking so many features. It just feels incomplete to me. Like they they wanted to make something bigger, but because of but because it had to be a launch title, they had to push it out quickly. So they had to cut out a lot of stuff. That's what it feels like to me. And then it feels like Times Water Two was the game they wanted to make. And after they you know actually had the time to do whatever they want, why does that have such like a long time on it? Um, but then, like, you know, after they had the time to sort of, like, develop at their own pace with Time Splitters 2, they made the game they actually wanted to make and it was way better. 
And then with Future Perfect, they um, they were they had EA as their publisher. Yeah, so I feel as that uh, Future Perfect had some stuff changed and rushed out a little bit as well because Future Perfect doesn't feel the most complete to me either. It still feels more complete. This game is a lot more complete, but Future Perfect comparatively is. I think the the second weakest game, the first one is the weakest, and then two is the best, without a doubt. And I'm going enough to stream there, because this has been a pretty short stream actually, it's only about two hours, but... Uh, yeah, it's, there wasn't really much for me to like do this time, really. Oh crap. Um... Because, uh, what you call it? Like, this is a really short game. Like, the main levels themselves are pretty short. Um, unless you want to like replay the levels over and over again to get your time down, then it's not really much reason to replay them. And I would personally just recommend playing Times Plus too because it's way better overall. Like, that's the, that's the basic thing here. It's like, you could play Time Splitters 1, or you could just play Time Splitters 2. And in general, I would just recommend Time Splitters 2, because it's better. In every single way. And if you don't like Time Splitters 2, it's good controls, and you want to listen to the best song in the entire... Well, one of the best songs in the entire soundtrack. Actually, I would say that the best songs in the entire series are in Future Perfect. But Time Splitters 2 has better levels and better gameplay. Um, and a better single player. Yeah, just play Time Splitters 2. <laughs> or Future Perfect if you don't like 2 that much. Which is understandable because 2 has really wonky ending. Anyway, I'm going to run off the stream. Uh, thanks for watching, and I will be back again. Uh, tomorrow? Yes, I think tomorrow. And then... Uh, Monday, I think is the schedule that I've got. Just look underneath the stream, everything you need to find is underneath the stream, including the schedule. It's down there. If I don't stream tomorrow, it's because something happened and I just couldn't bother streaming. So... Thanks for watching, I'll be back at some point in X amount of time. It shouldn't be too long because I'm trying to start streaming at least like once a week, but I'm gonna not just try and like disappear for like several weeks at a time and then just suddenly reappear because that's an issue that I had a lot before. Why am I changing the scene? I don't know. Why am I still talking? I don't know why I'm still talking. <laughs> I'll be back in tomorrow probably. I don't know what I'll be streaming because I never know um, in advance. So I'll see you then probably, unless I don't stream. <laughs> Thanks for watching.